Aloy, I see we have a new guest. So now we know the origin of the transmission. Yeah, I also recovered this. The weapon it was part of somehow stripped a zenith of its shield, but it malfunctioned and blew up. If we can recreate the weapon and improve it, maybe we'll gain the upper hand on the zenith. A moment, I will scan it. Complete. By combining the results with data from your focus, I can infer that the weapon was highly advanced, comparable to Zenith technology, but not how it worked. Did the explosion corrupt the data? It was only a catalyst. The moment the weapon malfunctioned, it appears a command executed to purge all data within its core, ostensibly this was to prevent the weapon's secrets from falling into enemy hands. Whoever designed this weapon knew how to cover their tracks. Silence. Based on your data on him, that is my conclusion as well. And he's not gonna cooperate with us? Well, it was worth a shot. But that's not all. The Zenus got Eleuthia, along with Artemis and Apollo. That is unfortunate. However, our original plan remains unchanged. The two remaining subordinate functions should increase my heuristic processing density enough to absorb Hephaestus. Right. One problem at a time. Well, I guess I better get back out there. I wish you luck on your search. Right. Thanks, Guy. So I guess we won't be making use of Cylon's weapon. And now there is another clone of Elizabeth here with us. But I can't let it distract me. I still have two more subfunctions to get. You okay? Huh? Oh, yeah, yeah. I mean, why wouldn't I be? Because there's two of me now. Hey, there's two of you now! Well, at least you seem to be handling it okay. Uh, I wouldn't say that exactly, but I'm trying. Did you speak with Beta at all? She didn't really wake up till we brought her here. And when she did, I, I thought it'd be better if Zoe and Varl took care of her. No use crowding someone when they're in a state. I see Varl gave you a focus. Well, it doesn't look as you know, fashionable on me, but by the forge, the things I've been able to see. Granted, a lot of them are bad, you know, the old world ending and such. I still try to wrap my head around most of it, but... I never really understood how you were ever able to find my sister back in the Sundom. And now I do, sort of. It makes me feel like I could be useful, you know? It takes some time, but yeah. I have to get going. Don't go causing too much trouble.
I just think she talks a lot. You would too, if you knew everything there is to know about everything. She can also crank out a whole army of machines to kick your sorry behind when she's fixed. Looks like some of the holograms are working now. I have repurposed the displays to track Regala's activity in the region. A useful war map. locked. Maybe Gaia will be able to get it open later. Aloy. Hey, thought I'd, uh, check in on how you're doing. You mean, after meeting someone who looks exactly like you, but isn't you, down in the basement? Guess this must be even stranger for you than it is for us, huh? A little. <laughs> Varl said she may be able to help us in our mission, though. Maybe. There is something I'd like to discuss. It's about the land gods. If you have time, that is. I need to get going. May the land bloom in your steps. I figured it'd start snowing soon. I recommend stopping by Salt Bite, a village north of the Grove. Their cooks test the soldiers' strength like nothing else. And who knows, maybe they could use your help, too. Maybe I'll check it out. Thanks.
It's from my stash when I need it. that machine until I find the right cauldron. So I'm going to one and I will try to find a show around here. So, keep it in the camp. Maybe I should check it out. Is there a house right here? I don't know if I'm here. That's all that looks damaged. I should take a closer look. Room gear. What are they doing here? That doesn't look good. I should check it out. Looks like the Osram used some kind of harpoon to take this machine down. I must have attacked the camp. Maybe my focus can help me figure out why.
to override the big guy. Break my fall. I can grab this from my stash later. Like we have company. Why not rest for a moment, friend? Now she's in the wilds, all alone. Forge knows all the things that could kill her out there. Someone ran off? I forgot her name. Kept quiet. Couldn't tell if she was shy or scared. All I know is she didn't want anyone near her things. That's for sure. I was just curious, is all. She didn't have to slug me. Your glass jaw ain't the problem, Lugnut. The girl is. All alone in the bush? And this is Tanakh territory. Which way did she go? West, up the slope. Look for her if you can. I will. Careful now. The girl's maladjusted. Are you sure there's a rebel outpost nearby? You're shoddy. I...
Spike is still intact. Rig's still playing. You okay there? You took out those machines. I'm grateful, but you should go now. There's nothing to see here. So this rig of yours, it's receiving sound through that wire from the thing up on the cliff, what you call a spike. But the message is only a fragment, and you're trying to pick up the whole thing? How did you figure all that out? I've learned a few things in my travels. If you want, we could talk about it. Maybe I can help? You do seem downright knowledgeable. So go ahead. Shoot. How did you first hear the message? I used to be a smith up in the claim. Wasn't an easy life. A lot of hard work without much to show for it. Then one day, I heard a whisper coming from a steel rod. Faint, like the last fingers of steam coming off a cooling forge. When I moved the rod around, the whispers got louder. I did some tinkering, built my rig, and did my best to follow that sound. Further west I came, the stronger it got. Then I found that spike up there. When I hooked up my rig, the words were clearer than ever. What do you think the message is? I don't know. There's something sad about it. Feels like it's from one lost soul to another. I'd sure like to know what it means. Let me have a look at that spike. I might be able to pick up more of that message. How? Let's just say I have a rig of my own. I didn't know Nora were tinkers. They're not. But I am, in a way. Be right back. Well, okay then. I guess. Just follow the wire to the spike at the top. And then please, just don't break anything. Dyer can make use of this. Better get climbing. Give her credit, lugging all that wire up a cliff wall. Oh, there's a spike. Might get better reception if I'm next to it. Interesting. Can't seem to get a fix on where the signal's coming from, though. Well, better let the tinker know I got a bit more of the message. This ought to be a good shortcut.
Your rig is picking up an old world message. A recording of some kind. Thought as much. Did you hear more of it? A bit. It was recorded during... A, a war. A bad one. Maybe that's why it sounds so darn sad. There's something about it that makes me think of my late brother. May his ashes stay warm in the forge. Not sure why, exactly. I, uh, I, I still can't get a fix on the source. Well, the words grew stronger when I got out here. What if you move the rig now? Try to see if you can get a stronger signal elsewhere. Even if I could dodge the Tanakh and the machines, I can't lose that spike. Nothing else pulls down the words better. Okay. If it's an old world message... Then let's try old world methods. They used to pinpoint signals by listening for them at three different spots. The taller the better. And then they combined the information and used it to find the source. And you can do that? I think so. But your spike is only one spot. I need two more, both up high. Oh. Well, there's a big bright tower in the Tanakh territory north of here. Yeah, that should work. I have another spot in mind near a place I'm uh, camping. Wait. I don't know your name. Or why you do all of this for someone you just met. Aloy. And because I want to know what's out there. Same as you. Selga. And when you find it, Aloy, I'd be eager to hear what it is. Full, but my stash has room. should help me pinpoint Silga's signal. Gotta climb up to look for Silga's signal. But where is the Higher. A 
almost there. Okay, let's see if I can pick up Silga's signal. yet. Climbing the mountain where my base is should finish the job. Here, your now weapon is cheap. Trade and trust. The Kakaro's on it. Outlander. The craft of the Tanakh awaits you. Who wants to... Play some strike. This is your opportunity to buy fine goods, Outlander. That's her. Strongest of the out. Stranger. I still have to get more of Silga's message. I should climb up the southern face of the mountain. There's gotta be a good spot up that way.
Everything in my focus is garbled. Silga's signal. Looks like I have company. Okay, I got the signal. Where is the best spot? I should try to find a good spot to pick up Silga's message. Spark one for two to enduring victory, Reno. The blue drop is gonna go. Pull. And free get this safely. I left a note for you inside. There. Found the signal's origin. It's not too far from here. I just need to get to it. I will get a nice view if I glide down from here.
for that machine yet. I better look at the new Focus is picking up the signal that Silka found. I'm going to clear out the machine before I can look for the source.
you be a focus. I hope this gets to you somehow. Along with the cure for the stand at the Reno line. Just wanted you to know that all the bit of this is water. I only remember the good things. And I'll think about them. When the darkness comes. Sounds like she really cared about it. Silga will want to know about this. And she'll definitely be interested in the transmitter inside that's been sending the message. Aloy! The words stopped coming from the spike. What happened? This is what was speaking to your rig. It's old-world equipment used for communicating over long distances. The message must have shut off when I took it, but... I heard the note the voice was talking about. What was it? During an ancient war, a woman was trying to deliver supplies to a man she knew. She wanted him to know that their past disagreements didn't matter in the big picture. I should be thinking of him when the end came. Oh. I guess she and I are kin of a sort. I wish I could give my brother a message like that. Tell him that I forgave him. He would have wanted that. I know. This man, the, the old one, did he ever hear the message? I guess that's often the way of it then. But still, with the power of that device you found, the sender had hope that he might have heard it. What a feat! To send messages near and far. Can I keep this? It's a treasure. Of course. Thank you. Sometimes, people don't ever get to hear what they should. But with this thing, maybe I can get them talking to one another. From Mainspring, all the way to who knows where. Hey, I, uh, I found a few more things in the supply cache. Might be able to make something out of them. Can I use your workbench? Sure. Yeah, right over there. Any time, Aloy. It's all yours. I think I know just what to do with these parts. That turned out well. Can't wait to try it. This will be in my stash when I need it. 